Alrighty, and we are recording. This is going to be a late night showing. It's going to be another hour. But I just got done with my PC setup. I got an L-shaped desk. I like the setup. I'm happy with it. If I want to upgrade, I'll probably upgrade, but that's not going to be for a while. But, anywho, on with the game. So, last time you saw, I was looking for Alexander. Um, so, I found the path to go and get him, because last you guys saw, I was struggling to get Alexander. So, I think he's in Volcano Manor. And we're going to find him. So let's bring up the map. If you guys hear noise in the background, it's just Cowboy Bebop playing in the background. But the place we need to go is actually up here. I thought I had a save. So, Bridge of Inquiry. No, we want to go here. Tomorrow's Monday. Not looking forward to it, but it's whatever. Alright. So, we have to get up on this plateau but oh found it so we go up here did a little research today and found it the way to where Alexander might be well while we're here We'll go ahead and smash this guy. Oh! Oh, shoot. Get away! I hate those skeletons. I don't know if I'm going to be able to kill this guy. Oh, snap. Let's just get rid of his reinforcements. Oh, man, that hurt. Oh, he did. He does take Scarlet Rod effect. Huh. Alright. So that's another death route. Cool. That's funny. I never knew Skeletons got Rot. So that guy's dead, and you need to be dead. So we got 27,000 from that. Alright. So we got that dealt with. So Torrent was 
Um, I actually learned, uh, research on this game, and, oh man, I forget the developer's name, the president of this game. Hedy Talker, or I, I forget his, forget his name. Um, but, um, Torrent came from possibly the, um, Impala from... Uh, Princess Mononoke. Huge Studio Ghibli fan, apparently. Uh, think the dungeon might be up here. There it is. And it takes some keys, it looks like. Awesome. Alright, so we'll mark it as that has... Alright. So let's go find where Alexander potentially is, because I think I know where he is. Alright, let's go. So the way is through here. Mount Galamia. Yes! We're going to sit down and upgrade our stats. All right, let's actually upgrade our flask. We also actually have to go down and get a sacred tear down here at this church. It's actually up in this area. And I'll show you a shortcut. Oh, nope. Oh, getting ahead of ourselves. Let's slow down here. All right, we're gonna level up. Oh man! Two thousand short. So let's see here. We're gonna do two. There we go. Twenty-eight, twenty-eight, twenty-eight. I want to do health. Perfect. Let's do this. And these uh, fire pits, I believe, came from, um, oh man, what is it, uh, Princess Bride, the uh, fire swamp. I mean, uh, all right. Give me a minute. I actually have to look up his name name now. Oh! Oh, man. Oh, man. 
Run away! <laughs> oh man, gotta love the random spawn in by enemies. Alright, so... I believe I'm safe. For now. Those guys are slow moving. Let's take a look here. Yeah, Hidetaka Miyazaki. The dude, uh, the dude is a big fan of pulp cult, pop culture. Really, he has really good taste in a lot of stuff, and I like the fact that Elden Ring has a lot of it. I don't know if it was purely his idea to put it in, or the creator. I want to say the creator of Game of Thrones, the author, is George White. I might have that wrong. I, uh... Um, but I honestly think they should do a game again together. I don't even know what George W. George W. White, I believe, is his full name. But, um, might actually have that wrong. I don't know. But, um, I think they should do another game together. I just like the fact that they put a lot of all the Souls game kind of in one Dark Souls 1. I don't know if there's any Dark Souls 2, 2 references in this game. Because I never played it. There's definitely Dark Souls 3. Um, Sekiro and Bloodborne in it. And and it, it's just it's just really great being able to catch, catch the quirky stuff in this. It's great. And be able to relate to it. Alright, so Alexander should be over here. I'm really not looking forward to killing this dragon, but it needs to be done. What in the... Oh. Oh, there he is. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. No, 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 no. Always oh, got bad timing on that. Alright. heal again. Oh man, my mimic is taking a pounding. Man, I moved just in time. I don't know if I'm going to be able to take him. Oh man, lava. Oh man. He took out my mimic. Oh, not in a good position. Not in a good position. Oh! 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 Man! Oh, man. Alright, so we're going to try that again. But first things first, we're actually going to rush around the dragon this time because Alexander is behind that huge rock. Let's see if we can actually go around without triggering the dragon. But I don't know if that's possible or not. Yep, he's still spawned. It looks like Alexander is not back there. Where... Oh, he is. There he is. Ha ha! Found ya! And it looks like the dragon doesn't care. But we're gonna... Alright. Well, that wasn't the button. Ah, good sir. I hardly think you're here to temple your skill. Timing, though. I've been making just a thing. Take it. 
the jaw. I won't be able. Perhaps I'll as an old saying above the law. Perhaps I'll head it as an old saying above the law. Eastward. As an old saying above the law. All right. So we've extinguished his dialogue. The dragon now realized that we're over here. Got that rune. All right. Oh my word, these trees! We're gonna... Give him a good Scarlet Rot. Hopefully that sticks. I don't think one Blast is going to do, so he's going to need two. going to give him another Blast. Oh no, we weren't close enough. <gasps> oh man. All right, so now he's Scarlet Rot. Come on, get out of the lava, dude. I hate the smoldering fire. Oh man, he just plows through my mimic tier and I don't like it. Oh no! Oh man, I have no idea how the heck I survived that. Oh man, I have an aggroed. Nope, nope, not today. Looks like, uh. Ah! Oh no, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, shoot! Alright, he's on me, he's on me. Come on, come on, come on. Gotcha! I guess having my mimic on uh, Scarlet Rot duty does the trick. <laughs> but what we are going to continue doing is going to go on, get the most OP magic spell in the entire game. It is all sorcerers of Elden Rings and all of Dark Souls. In Dark Souls 3, I, I believe it was not in Dark Souls 1 or 2. Azura's Comet. It's the most fastest, most OP. Um, okay, not fastest, but most OP spell right off the bat you can get. It has a hell of a wind-up. <laughs> I mean, you could uh, pair it up with Azura Staff and speed up that way. With and also uh, and pair it with Radagon's Icon. Oh. Oh my word. All right. Oh yes, the pulley crossbow. That is actually a really fun crossbow to use. Um, I think we're going to level up again.
I'm gonna live in style. Oh my word. Okay, you're pushing me, you're pushing me. Stats. Go and get Azura's Comet just for the hell of it. And we have to kill that demi human. Alright. Oh man, how did we aggro the demi human queen? Alright, alright. That's fine. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my word! No, 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 no! Woo! That was close. Give it here. Yes. Uh, comment Azure, not Azura's comment, but either way. All right. So now it's time for killing that demi human. We're actually going to go up here real quick. get this that's that um, dungeon that we want to to get the ghost ghost wart for my mimic Mount Gelmir dungeon gonna spawn in there we're gonna do that I'm gonna Make sure he has dual wield katanas, and then we're gonna blast. Perfect. And then we're gonna support our mimic tier and blast again. He is doing devastating damage against. We're gonna hop in there. Oh! Sorry. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, come on. Quit backing up, bro. There we go. Sucker! And yeah, just like that. If you kill the uh, demi queen, demi human queen. All the rest of the mages fall like it was using them as puppets or something. Something I noticed. Alright, so now Alexander should be at the location he should have been. Alright, so... Oh, also, we actually need to go and get the Nagakiba. The long katana. That requires me to go to... Oh, man. Think, 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 think. Oh, man. Brain fart, brain fart, brain fart. We need to go... Oh, man. This is... This isn't good. I want to say we need to go to this church, but I'm not sure. Ah. Uh... Man, the Nagakiba, Nagakiba. I want to say it's at the church here, but... I don't think so. 
There's that church there, though. Oh, man. Ah. We actually have to go get the golden needle as well here for Melina. Oh man, I want to say it's there. I might be wrong. Uh, we'll travel there real quick, but I... I can't, I don't think it's there. It's got to be near the capital, the chapel. All right. Oh, wait. Where am I looking? No, that's the wrong chapel. Oh, I think this is ruins. This is ruins. Dang it, that's the ruins off to the right. Dang it. I knew I was right. <sighs> okay. It, it, yeah. Yeah, that's not it. Uh, because the only castle I know... Uh, church, I know... That's the mage school. That's not it. That's not it. I know that's not it. Nothing. Nothing's triggering me. I swear it's up here. It's up here near the forest. I want to say it's that. But I need to ride there first. We're going to go for a ride, because I want to get the Nagakiba, increase my range. And we're not going to go against the Godskin yet, we're going to wait till I get Melina, it's not going to be that long to get her. Um, ba -ba -ba -da 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 I need a ride. Ride, Torrent. Ride my steed. Well, we need to go off to the right here. Still shooting stuff at me? There's actually an illusion in this fortress. We're not going to trigger that right now. I'm going to go and pick up that. We got ourselves a graveyard and a lot of runes. Alright. We got that. Dang it. Is that it? I want to say nope. That ain't it. Alright. Whoa! Ah! Too close to enemies. Oh, look at that. Really wish how the gen randomly generating skulls worked, because that would just be cool to straight up farm them countlessly. I don't think I should be going this way, but... No! No, we need to turn around. I'm pretty sure there's a dungeon down there or they wouldn't have made the path, but... If 
put a lot of just to and and the when going up against a giant enemy and he strikes down a tree that is detail i absolutely love the destruction of of the uh battleground it, it's just pay attention paying attention to detail that that is cool all right so we got another gray site should be but I'm almost a oh man we're going in the wrong directions this is where the black knife is dang it <sighs> I really don't want to go against the black knife Oh, I can actually. I didn't know you could actually spawn your your uh, to get help. No. Oh man, he has the dragon. God dang it. Oh well. Here we go. Double dragon breath, how do you like that? Oh, shoot! Oh, he's poisoned now, so... Uh, la la la... How do you like that, buddy? Let's try and get behind her. As you all know, all the black knives are female. Gotcha! Having that rot uh, blasted at your enemy continuously is actually really useful. Not gonna lie. Continuous stream of rot. Most OP status effect I've ever known. Besides blood loss. But we're gonna go down here. We're also gonna mark it. As an unfinished... And I believe the chapel I marked is the correct chapel. Alright, let's go. Go, 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 go! I bought the telescope I'm not gonna lie I believe it's I we actually oh oh man that was close <laughs> that would have sucked so we actually have to go we actually have to go down just look at that view. Just look at that view. I really, I really hope they continue soul like soul games. Media. 
Hitaka, Hitaka. That another graveyard? It is. All right. Oh, okay. All right. You guys don't like me. I get it. I get it. You guys don't want me picking around. All right. Let's get the heck out of here. So we got 26,000. I think it's time to get to a graves. Sign of grace. Is someone following me? Yeah, I need to get to a grace site. Oh my word, this... I have not a single grace site. Um... Well... Ah, uh, well, probably the... Oh, man, I don't even have that. Oh, no! God dang, I hate doing that. Well, probably the fastest way down is going to be at this side of grace. So we're going to just go here, travel down, get that side of grace, travel down, go to the chapel, because I believe that is the chapel. But real quick, we're going to upgrade again level up so we need 30,000 so see if that's enough nope oh what was it just a few more hundred yup 900 god this should be enough. Watch the magic happen. Perfect. No! Oh, God. We just need a few. You know what? I'm going to ambush this squad. Kidding me, right? There we go, we got enough. All right, let's not aggro that night. All right, here we go. I'm gonna level up. All right, let's go. We actually need to go back to the round table because and upgrade my Uchi katanas. To be honest, but. Let's make our way up here. We're going to go go back to the east and switch that back. We also need to go to the church to the south. Oh yeah, that teleports us straight to the windmills. I forgot. Should have done that. Uh -huh. I need to remember that. Let's go talk to this guy. You actually have something I want. Alright. I want to mark you as valuable. 
Here we go. Gotta ride. Yeah. Oh! Oh man, that was bad. Huh. Wait, why do I have two markers? After we get down, we have to go up here. Where in the heck is my other marker? Uh, there's one. Hmm. There's one. And there's two. And it's pointing this way. I'm not seeing it. Oh well. Let's go. Yep, we're gonna go over here. And then we have to strategically mark our way. To number two. These guys are from number three. The snake heads or whatever the heck they are. Oh, there's a sign of grace. We're going to go and get that sign of grace real quick. Oh, yes, I remember. It, it is that one because I remember the first time playing this that I had to make that jump. That whirlwind jump. So we are on the right path. Should be over here. There it is. I'm gonna go in here. Oh my! Oh, that was useless. I thought that was some, gonna be something valuable. And we make that jump. The castle straight ahead. Gotta kill an NPC. Get a sacred tear. Oh, shoot. Oh! Oh! Okay, okay, you be playing. And, uh, alright, when the. I don't even. Oh! Oh! Oh, man! This is bad. Come on. Oh, you. You got nothing now, bud. Gotcha. Oh, thank God the Scarlet Rot dogs didn't get in on this. Alright, so, we got the blade. Um, uh oh, I'm afraid I might have missed out on the Uchi Katana. Not the Uchi, but the Nigakiba. Oh no, where's this dead body? Should have been in the castle. Oh, 
I know what I forgot. I know exactly what I forgot. We actually have to go to this bridge over here. Right? Yes, we have to go to that bridge. Should be a sign. A summon sign. We help him defeat uh, another bloody finger. Then he appears at that church dead or dying. Yeah, dying. And then after we defeat the NPC, which we just defeated, he gives us the Niga Ki the Niga Kiba. Oh man, look at that. Just look at that. Freaking beautiful. Alright. So we go over here. Should be a summons unless I messed it up. And I think I messed it up because it should have been right here. God dang it. Yeah, I think I messed it up. Yeah, I messed it up. Dang it. Well. Uh, I talked to him at the mountainside. up right here because I'm pretty sure I because I'm pretty sure I can't find him again after I have Because he's usually over here. But I doubt he's over here since he's already died and moved on. Oh, man. Wait, he isn't under here. Yeah, he isn't under here. He's under the other one across. So we have to ride all the way across. Very first time I... Oh. 
Hey, look at that! The Nigakiba! Nagakiba. Oh my word. So, either way, you still get it. I like how forgiving on the uh, NPCs. Like how um, in this game it's a little bit more forgiving if you mess up the side quests of the uh, NPCs. So let's actually see what this thing can do. Seriously, strength of 18? Dang it. So now let's actually go back because I need to upgrade a few things. What did you see? New items can be purchased. He's still not in there good because his daughter still hasn't spawned. I'm going to offer a bell smithing stone. Five and six. There's the last talisman's pouch, which is good. But as of right now, let's see if we can add anything onto the Nagakiba. Really? Oh, that's somber smith. Let me see here. Somber smithing stone. Let me guess. Somber smithing stone. Somber smithing stone. Somber somber. I can add another effect on it. Blood loss. And that actually takes a smithing stone. Okay. status effect all right so I want the Nagakiba but I want to see what I can do for the ashes of war for the Nagakiba it might duplicate that but we might just put the stomp on it We can't always re reset my attributes, honestly, if I wanted to, to just to use the right hand, the Nagakiba. I'm not even going to lie about that, because the Nagakiba is a really, really nice weapon. I've never actually used it. The only reason why I would use it is for the reach. So, let's... Yeah, yeah. Ooh, man, look at that. Oh, man, look at that reach. We might actually go back. Oh, man, look at that reach. I really don't like the fact that I can't attack right now. But since we have all four talisman slots, what we can do is... Oh, man, strength only goes to 17. Dang it. Shoot, 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 shoot. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Uh, what do I do in this pinch? The actual question is... Oh. 
I ain't gonna lie, I really like the, uh... I honestly really like the Omen Byron. It's it's really nice to have. It's a really cool animation of how they just hone in on one enemy. Man, I'm just a few things shy. Yes, yes. I might actually just duplicate the stomp. Let's just go and duplicate the stomp. First of all, I'm going to do this. There we go. We'll just go in and get it. Yeah, 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 go forth. And then we can go to Renala, rebirth, and then bring my strength up so I can use the Nagakiba. And we'll just do that. Because I really want to use the Nagakiba for that reach. That reach is supreme. That reach is deadly, and I honestly can't wait to actually have dual wielding Nagakibas. Ain't gonna lie. So what we're going to do is Ash of War Duplication, and I want to do the Stomp. No, no, I'm not even going to duplicate that. I'll just switch it over. But first, what I want to do is go to Renala's Bed Chambers, and we're going to... We're gonna increase my stats. Where did he flee, my sweeties? Rebirth, yes. Fifteen. Ten. I hope that's right. That needs to be 18. One there. One there. Needs to be 105. One there. We'll put everything at 20. Oh, shoot. One, two. Oh, no. There we go. All right, now we can use the Naga Kiba. hasn't affected me too much, but right now we're going to go and farm a crap ton of things. Uh-oh. Oh no, I think I messed up. No, Arcane's 10. Faith is 10. Uh-oh, what did I mess up? What did I mess up? Oh man, Arcane is 12. Oh man, Adam, you messed up. Shoot! Oh well. Oh, is it thy way? 
Yeah, sure, whatever. Wait, I'm missing something. Oh, magic. God dang it. It's 105. Dang. I want to make sure I didn't mess it. Oh, Arcane 12. I almost messed that up. Holy cow. Thank God I... Arcane 12, Faith 15, Strength 18, Dexterity. I think I got it. There we go. There we go. Alright. We're good to go. Now, what we need to do is... Is make Nagakiba my friend. <laughs> All right, we're just over an hour, so we gotta wrap this up here pretty soon. All right, we gotta buy a lot of smithing stones, but as of right now, we need to move the Ash of War over of the stomp. Yes, we're gonna make it cold. Perfect. We can do that, but okay. I still haven't got the whetstones for it yet to do that yet. All right. So, um, I actually would like to know which whetstones I'm missing. That's actually would be a really good tool to have. All right. So, first things first, we gotta go and farm. I actually have to go and kill the Ancestral Deers, both of those, so I can get the FP Talisman, so whenever I kill somebody, it gives me FP. Alright. Oh, this ain't good. Oh, man. Oh, man. I did not think that the Nagakiba was going to weigh more. I messed up on that big time. And it's not even upgraded. Oh, my word. It's not even upgraded. And it weighs more. How much more does it weigh? heavy load it weighs that much more man are you serious man Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come and get some. Come and get some. Come on. Come on. 
Quit doing your acrobats and now you're stuck. Come on. What are you doing, dude? Come and get some. Oh, well, you messed up. <laughs> I think. Yep, there he goes. Stab you and give you the goods. Just like that. We're gonna, I guess, not backstab you. Give you the goods. Come on, come on. That's it. There we go. That double strike attack does. There we go. We're gonna shove you off my blade. Perfect. Got a rune. Then we're actually gonna go back and fast travel. Time is at freaking eleven. All right, let's do this. Still haven't talked to him. It's great. Let's go and upgrade the Nagakiba. Gonna have to reduce my armor just to sadly compensate for. For the Nagakiba. Not too thrilled about it. Alright. We need 11. Oh man, I was short. Wait. Four, five, six, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Twelve. Oh my word, I'm I'm dumb. Six plus six is twelve. Duh. Do you the math? Alright, here we go. believe I am broke yep so what we're gonna do is go farm some more get the Nagakiba up 
Another 20,000 runes? Pull you off. Perfect. That red guard's gonna see me. We're gonna stab you in the back. Ah! Uh. Do our little consumption thing. This guy's gonna do his little acrobats. Perfect. I'm gonna stab you in the back. This is such a great farming place. That guy's dead. Oh, two for one. Awesome. Sucker. What? What happened to the other guy? Oh man, I went into his firing range. All right. There's another. Did he? Oh my! Seriously, dude? Come on! <sighs> That's what I get for not paying attention. Another twenty thousand. You can actually farm a lot. The, this play. This just. This place is insane. Once I have the. Right equipment. Once I get the, I mean, Elder Blade. I don't. I forget what it is. The blade made out of Radagon from the Elden Beast. And then you get the Golden Scabbard along with it, and you can make just I don't know if the developers and we did it again. That guy actually had more this time, too. So we'll go in. Alright. Let's go in. I'm gonna snatch the goods. We're gonna get on out of here. Oh, wait, we need to... Perfect. Alright, let's get back to the round table and upgrade the Nagakiba. Also need to upgrade my other blade. Okay, I'm out. <laughs> Alright, so smithing stone, I have absolutely none of four, so we gotta get 12 of four. We need 12 of 5. Wait a minute. Am I doing less or more damage?
The other one was level 14, so... Oh, there goes all the cash. Oh, we'll upgrade it anyways. Let's go. It's a thousand. Alright. Ash of War on... So what the damage would be, it was 152 and 121, 121, 152 and 121, that's level 14, 143, 114, does the Naga Kiba seriously do less damage? Man, that's gonna suck. Hundred sixty-one and ten. Ash of War duplication. Sixty-five and thirteen. Twelve hundred. Oh, there we go. There's that boost. So it's the same exact stats at level 14. Holy cow. Hey. Cool. I like that. It has the same stats as just a regular katana. Uchi. All right, cool. I like that. That's a lot of good news on for me. So I need to go get one more, and we'll be at the same stats as the Uchi Katana. But after this, we'll go get Alexander, and we'll end the video because we're almost running on an hour and a half. So we'll wrap it up here. We'll do one. So that's the exact same reading, 152 and 64 and 11. So as we, nope, as we change it, so 152 and 121, 152 and 121, 25, 
That's... So it does just a little bit less damage by three points because it's 65 and 13 on the other one because... Sixty-five and thirteen. That's awesome. All right. It, it doesn't matter right now. I have the extra reach. It's fine. Let's go get Alexander, and that will be the end of the video. It's kind of. Let's go get it and end the video. It's just a really cool weapon. It's like the katana from Final Fantasy, Seth Roth's katana. It's just extremely long. This has been in every single Dark Souls game, also known as the washing pole or whatever the heck it's called. You should hear Alex's voice, Alexander's voice. Is I wrong again? What? You said he would go east. So after he went up there, he goes east. So honestly, he should actually be waiting for me at the, uh, Fire Giants location. So, that's actually going to wrap up the video for today. I don't know. I'm surprised he doesn't show up here. It's kind of weird. I guess if you do things in, out of order, NPCs can skip areas, it looks like. All right. Kind of don't like the fact that the Nagakiba does three three less points of damage than the regular katana, but it has that insane reach, as you can see. Like, holy cow! Guess it's my first time doing one of those. But anywho, that's the end of the video. Um, yeah. Phantom of Death out. See you guys later.